Hello everyone and welcome to another Looker Studio tutorial. Today we're going to learn how to add page filters in Looker Studio. Before we go straight to the point, please like the video and subscribe to the channel. It helps tremendously to create new content. So thank you very much in advance and off we go. So you want to apply a filter to your entire Looker Studio report. So let's say, for example, that you have a report that basically shows you data on all the countries and you want to narrow down this report to only, let's say, India, right? So what you're going to do is you're going to go on the top, click on page, and then you're going to click on current page settings. And once you click on current page settings, you're going to come here, you're going to click on add a filter under the setup column. And you are going to go and click on create a filter down here. And let's create our filter. We're going to call it India. And we're going to include here the country of, I'm going to say here, either equals or contains. I like to say contains just in case we do some minor spelling mistakes. India, we're going to save. And that's it. So now the entire report is narrowing down to the country of India. Right? So it's as simple as that to create a page filter on Looker Studio reports. And obviously, you can create any filter that you like, right? So country is just one option. So let's say you want to filter down the entire report to only, let's say, mobile traffic, right? So what you're going to do again is one more time, click on page, current page settings. Under the setup column, you click on add a filter. You're going to create a filter here. Let's name this mobile traffic. Let's not misspell it also. And here we're going to select device category. So that we're going to say that the device category contains mobile, right? And we are going to save our filter. And now the entire, basically, uh, the entire page is filtered down to mobile traffic. What is very important is to navigate perhaps to your Google Analytics and understand when you are basically creating these filters, what are the dimension names, right? So now I don't see any data, so I'm getting suspicious. Maybe I didn't really create the filter correctly, right? So I want to understand exactly what is the name of the dimension in Google Analytics 4 so I can use that in my Looker Studio and I can, let's say, correctly create the filter, right? And here we go. So mobile is with lowercase m. So the mistake that I made here is that I applied the filter mobile traffic with an uppercase m, right? So we need to actually change that to mobile. And now we're going to see some data coming in. Here we go. So always very important to understand what is the exact name of the dimension in Google Analytics 4 and use that to create your filter. So learn from my minor mistake here, basically. And other than device, country, you can really filter down to any channel that you want, any source, any medium, any source slash medium. So maybe a third example, let's say that we want to filter down to organic search. One more time, what is important is to understand here, for example, in Google Analytics 4, what is the exact name of the dimension that we want to filter down to. So we have, let's say here, organic social. Let me actually go to another account that has more traffic so we can, we can see more channels. And let's understand the exact name of the dimensions because this is exactly what we want to filter, to use as a filter when we want to apply a page-wide filter to our, uh, basically, uh, to our Looker Studio report. So now here my, my Google Analytics is acting, but you get the logic. For example, I can come here, I can delete this filter. Again, you go to page, you go to current page settings, you go under the setup column, you click on add a filter, you create a filter, and let's actually narrow down, for example, to organic search. We can say that the session default channel group contains, for example, organic or contains organic search. So if I say contains organic, it means 
is going to filter down to all the channel groups that contain organic, organic search, organic social, and so forth. A question that a lot of you ask at this stage is, can I filter to down, let's say, only for some of my scorecards or some of my charts? So maybe you don't want to apply a page-wide filter. Maybe you want to apply a filter only to some of these visualizations that you have here in this report. And the answer is yes, you can do that. So here I removed all my page filters. So we don't really have any page filter. And what I can do in this case is I can maybe select these two scorecards, then maybe one by one. So let's say the first one. Maybe I can scroll down here under the setup column. I can click on add the filter. And I can have this specific scorecard basically filtered down to India, for example. And I can have this bar chart here, this column chart filtered down to, let's say, organic traffic, right? So you can apply filters either as page-wide filters, so you can filter down an entire page to whatever dimension you like, or you can select certain visualizations one by one, and you can filter them down to a certain dimension. Why this is helpful? This is helpful because imagine you have a Looker Studio report, you can create a top-level report relevant to all the countries, for example, that your website is getting traffic from, and then you can create a duplicate of that page and you can narrow down to Brazil, another duplicate you can narrow down to India, another duplicate you can narrow down to Indonesia, for example, Singapore, and so forth. Or you can do the same with channels. So you have all the traffic in your top level report, and then you have only paid search, only organic search, only email, right? So that's how filters are useful in your day to day. That's it. Instructions can be found also in the video description. If you manage to do it, please like the video and subscribe to the channel. Have a great day in any time zone and see you in the next video. Hi, everyone.